barbecue food for you. Today, showing everyone a great, easy, and delicious way to cook a whole chicken using a beer can holder on a rotisserie. And a rinse under some cold water. Take that string off. After the chicken's washed and dried, go in, just cut these wing tips off. If you like them, nice and burnt, crispy, leave them on. And we'll go in, clean up some of this excess fat. To season the bird, we're going to be using Meathead Simon and Garfunkel Rub from AmazingRibs.com. If you want to learn how to make it, all the info is there. Just take your finger underneath the chicken skin and throw in a little bit and just rub it around. You can see it gets all under the skin. And give a good coating to the outside of the bird too. Go ahead. Put a little bit on the inside of the bird too. Take your hand, rub it around a little bit. Then we're going to put a couple little pieces of butter underneath the skin too. Just push it in. Then take the beer can holder and place the chicken on it. Find this easier to get started laying down like this. You can see where you got to put it. With the chicken on the stand, just lay it down, place your rotisserie right through the middle. And just lightly poke it in. With this style of beer can holder and rotisserie, we're going to tie it up in four spots. Two spots here, keeping the beer can holder to the rotisserie. And then we're going to take the legs and tie them up too. With the chicken legs and the beer can holder tied up, just bend it up to keep this chicken nice and straight. And just stick the top part of the rotisserie right through for a good tight fit. And screw it down. The grill we're going to be cooking the chicken on is a 22 and a half inch Weber kettle. We're going to be using their rotisserie attachment with maple leaf, 100% pure hardwood. Set up your coals on one side of the grill for indirect cooking. Get the rotisserie attachment on. We'll get the lid on. But this time we're going to stick a probe right through the top. Let it hang down around 8 inches or so. Got the grill sitting just over 300 degrees. Before you put the chicken on, we're going to throw a chunk of apple wood in. For the wood, place it right on the coals. Go get that chicken. Just got the chicken on the rotisserie spinning around nice and smooth. You can see that chunk of apple wood is just starting to light up. So we're going to shut the lid, check on it in around 40 minutes. Chicken's been rolling on that rotisserie for around half an hour now. Pour your temp gauge out. And we'll take a peek. Now quickly check the temperature. 165, 166, right on. Take it off. Just off the grill and looking great. Gonna let it rest for around three minutes or so. Then we're gonna start carving right into it. To get the chicken off real easy, just cut the two strings that you attach to the rotisserie. And that chicken will just slide right off on the beer can holder. Cut it right down the middle, see how it's looking. Slice off a nice piece of breast meat here. Look at that, just dripping juice. Check that out, nice and juicy. It's easy to do. Barbecue food for you. Give it a try. Mm.